So this is some bad news. South Korea, 20% tax on crypto profits. I had no idea that South Koreans didn't have to pay taxes on capital gains or anything for cryptocurrency until like right now. I'm like, wow, I should move to South Korea. So what is happening here? Bum, bum, bum. The South Korean government said on Friday that income derived from trading cryptocurrency will be subject to tax as planned, clearing the way for the 20% tax on the gains made via digital currency that long remained a windfall tax-free investment. That is awesome. Imagine just making all these, these gains and just going, okay, now I'm going to cash out and uh, the government doesn't get anything. Fantastic. That's fantastic. I would love that. doesn't work here in the United States or Canada or all over Europe. Well, for the most part. Uh, there's different places you can get, you can get away from that. But uh, yeah, Australia, can't do that. Deputy Prime Minister and Finance Minister uh, Hong Nin Kai, pretty sure I know that, and Digital Assets can be recognized as financial assets. He states the crypto market, with around 400 billion, sure, has long remained outside the tax authority's scrutiny. That will no longer be the case following a revision of a related law, Hong said during a government audit of the Ministry of the National Assembly Thursday. So basically, he just set out and goes, look, uh, good for you guys. You guys uh, got one over on us, but not anymore. We're going to step in. And the reason why I'm talking about this article so much is because I see this what's going to happen with governments coming in. They are going to start to impose more taxes, especially on these windfalls, especially on these capital gains, because look what happened globally. Now, let's just take a look at the United States. Uh, we're hurting. We're hurting because we printed off so much money and there was so, I mean, the money printer really did go burr. And you can't print that much money without having some repercussions. I mean, not for the, the billionaires. They're going to be fine. You know, they're going to get richer uh, and that's just how it goes. But for people like you and me, it's going to start sucking real bad. And I can see how taxes will go up. Now, hopefully uh, we can tax more of the rich, but I'm uh, in my 40s and I've been hearing that song and dance for uh, decades. <laughs> Still doesn't happen. So I have no faith in the government. However, there is one thing that I do have faith in. That's that they're going to tax the living hell out of me. So what's going on down here? So the grounds of the move was established by the relevant law revised in July to impose on Korean citizens, including residents and non-residents and foreign nationals. So even if you weren't a citizen of Korea and you're living there, you're going to get taxed. Gains made by non-residents and foreigners after October 1st, 2021, will be subject to a tax rate of either up to 20% of the difference between sell price and purchase or a 10% transfer price. Either amount, whichever is lower, must be paid on the 10th every month. So gains made by non-residents and foreigners after October 1st will be subject to a tax rate. So the, I think this is what's going to happen. Uh, exchanges that are located in South Korea, if you're using them and you have some gains and you cash out, it sounds to me like you're going to have to pay taxes. Not 100% for sure. need a CPA. I need uh, Chandra's card to actually come in here and actually help me with this one. Because if you're going to pay tax over there, then, and then it comes over to, the, let's say you live in the States, and now you have it. So you can't get double tax, can you? Jeez, that sounds awful. Anyhow, where is a CPA? Put that in the comment section. Koreans, by contrast, will have to pay a 20% tax for gains made in a one-year period over 2.5 million won. Well, whatever that conversion is. So, so South Korea, you got away with one. Congratulations. Unfortunately, you got to pay the piper now, and that's just how it goes. To finish up, there's two things. Um, I see this happening more and more. I do believe that we're going to be taxed a lot more coming up, and that's just how it is. And that's just, uh, you know, par for the course. So, time to make a plan now. If you fail to plan, you're planning to fail. And that's just the darn truth. So, look, here's my plan. My plan is not to pay taxes, period. I mean, I already pay taxes uh, through my business and all the different income that I have right now. Now, if I have to pay taxes, like let's say one Bitcoin goes to a million, just saying could happen, who knows, uh, for round numbers. So that means if I bought it today, let's just say it's 10,000, right? I have to pay the taxes on $990,000, probably about 25%, 15 to 25% of capital gains, probably gonna be a ton. Uh, I am not doing that. I am not doing that because who knows how long I'm going to live. So, and and second of all, I don't think that I should be taxed that much. It's ridiculous, right? So I have, and I recommend you to check this out, do whatever you want. I trust capital. They have a crypto IRA. 
you put your crypto in there. Not all of it. You're not going to put all of it because, you know, it has to sit there until you're 59 and a half or 65 and 59 and a half so you can take it out. But when you're able to take it out, guess what? You pay zip and low taxes. Zip, zero, zilch, none. So I personally, uh, you can max it out. It's between six and seven thousand dollars, depending on your age, and that's what I put in. I'm almost maxed out uh, for this year, so that's just how it is. But I'm not going to pay any taxes on those cryptocurrencies. So uh, you can start one up, or if you have a traditional IRA or an old employer plan, 401k, 403b, TSB, or 457, then you can move them all over tax-free if you want to. So to watch this video and use the link to check it out. There's a link in the description of every one of my videos, it looks just like this. And there's also the video, how I break everything down, how I talk about it, you're not gonna pay any taxes and how it all works out. If you use my link, you get a month for free. And also when you go to the website, if you have any questions, uh, just click on the contact us and you get to live, talk to like a real live person. Usually Anthony or Blake or somebody will talk. So, and they're all good guys. So uh, just check that out. Again, that's my plan to not pay taxes. I don't know where you want to go, but that's my option. All right, so that's it for today. So before we take off, I just want to give some uh, random shout outs to everybody who signed up at Digital Asset News. Really appreciate it. Uh, we've got uh, P-Dub and Stone Crypt. Uh, that's Freddy. The Stone Book or Shield Folio. Thanks, man. Chef Dan, Ital Schur, Steve Ehrlich, Chris Castillo, Daniel Delgado, TTP911, GK, P Black. I am not I. I am not I. And uh, Ether, Ether, Ether Black and Chucksy. So... Thanks everybody for signing up, really appreciate it. If you like these types of videos, there's gonna be two months gonna pop up on your left and right. I'm gonna try to uh, put the one about not paying taxes. It's like an 18 minute video, it kind of goes through everything. You can check that out. And also the other one is uh, whatever YouTube picks. And that is uh, it for today. So again, thanks for sticking with me, appreciate it. And I'll see you on the next one.